Yeah, can you just, just get it here first thing in the morning and I'll see what I can do? Look, I'm gonna have to go, sorry. Jack, give me that, babe. Turn around and Thank you, thank you. You can let have a spanner. Let go. <laughs> oh, Ross! <laughs> Ross! Lifesaver, listen, I know that it's your day off, but I I've got childcare issues. Do I look like a nanny? Uh, like I'd even leave you with Sarah's goldfish. No, what I'm saying is we've got jobs booked in. I'm desperate. It's not my problem. Uh, excuse me, what is wrong with you? No, I just left my phone here. Uh, yeah, well, it has been bleeping all morning, so it turns out you have got mates. <laughs> have you been reading this? Oh, listen, what you and Donna go up to is her bad luck. Mm. Bye, then. Where'd you disappear to last night? Left Adam in a right foul mood. What do you think? I wasn't gonna hang around with him mouthing off, was I? And he's still not paid his rent, which I reckon is grounds for me to ask him to pack his bags. Well, at least we know he handles bad news well, eh? I was hoping you'd back me up. Suppose I could talk to him, if you do something for me. Well, no brew. It's not very polite. I don't remember you asking before putting our Finn in hospital. Or your little girlfriend before she tried to fit me up yesterday. Keep Donna out of this. Got you right round her little finger, that copper. There's a bloke, Stephen Banks. Owns some nightclubs round here. There's an envelope in his safe that I want. What's in it? Holiday to the Bahamas? Something I want back. You're gonna get it for me. So what? Just stroll in, help myself. He don't take kindly to people poking about in his clubs. Too many skeletons. As luck would have it, he's in court in a couple of weeks, so you'll have the perfect window. Oh, yeah, perfect. And how am I supposed to gain access to a safe, exactly? You'll think of something. Clever lad like you. And if I don't want to do it? Just think about Finn. Or me. Whichever works for you. Cheer up. There'll be a month's takings in that safe. You get past his security and reckon you've earned it. Imagine how much air gel you could buy with that. So where is this place? When did you in court? I'll tell you when you need to know. So are you laughing, boy? What? Other than having a prat for a half-brother? <laughs> Andy caught up with you yet? No way, what's he want? He's on about asking you to move out. He sounds serious this time. Why? Well, it might be because you're dead messy. Or that you fancy his missus. Hey, I won't have Katie back if she begged me, mate. That's not what you said yesterday. Look, he knows your skin. What's in it for him? <sighs> so... Let me get this right, cos I won't go back to the farm, I'm gonna lose my home as well. Classy. Unless you pay him his rent and give him no choice. I've got something coming up. Could give us both a big payday. Yeah, and what's that? A bloke I know needs someone to break into a club and take something from a safe. Take something from the safe? Mate, you need your head testing. It sounds well dodgy. Oh, come on, mate. I'm trying to give you a lifeline here. I gave you the heads up about Andy, didn't I? So what? I thought I was a liability anyway. Thought nicking chocolate bars was about my level, remember? <laughs> I was I was messing, wasn't I? Yeah, well, I'm not doing it. What? So, Andy wins? It's hardly like you can move back home if he chucks you out, is it? Well, better that than getting banged up or in A&E. Yeah, and if I don't do this job, I won't make it as far as A&E. There'll be no last-minute rescue like Finn. He'll probably finish me off. What's this got to do with Finn, Ross? It was you, wasn't it? You're the reason why Finn got attacked. You don't know the facts, all right? Oh, I... <laughs> you know, some big brothers, they stop at embarrassing you in front of your mates, but you, no, no, you, you got to properly shaft someone, haven't you? Yeah, cheers for that. Finn's going to go mad, you do realise? <sighs> oh, man, you are screwed. I'll tell you what, though. You pay Andy my rent, 
And I won't tell Finn what a scumbag of a brother you really are.